So now that we can introduce ourselves a couple of different ways, we uh, definitely want to start working on a big repertoire of different greetings to use for different times of the day, for more formal or informal contexts, and for different size groups of people that we're greeting. So I've got here a few that you no doubt have heard before, but let's go through them. And uh, throughout the course, the coursework, you will find other ways if and take notice when people send emails and different things like that and how they've used different greetings at the start and farewells at the finish of those emails. So we've got Kilda and people ask me that someone said Kilda to me the other day when I gave them something. And yes, as well as meaning hi, it also we've adopted it as our thank you, which is a cool thing because literally Kilda means to be well. We're wishing someone to be well. So every time we say kia ora, not only are we saying hello or thank you, we're also having wishing them to be well, which is kind of nice, I reckon. So kia ora uh, for hi, g'day, all sorts of different things. Um, perhaps a more formal way of saying hello to a person is tēnā koe. Tēnā koe. So there's that kupu koe that we were talking about before. This means hello to one person. Tēnā koe. And making sure we pronounce the macrons, the tohu to on tēnā. So it's not tēnā, it's tēnā. Tēnā kōrua. Kōrua means two people. So tēnā kōrua is greeting two people. And we're speaking to those two people. Uh, and tēnā koutou. Koutou is our group pronoun for when we are speaking to a group of three to whatever. So three to infinity and beyond, tēnā koutou. So great um, greeting to use if you're addressing assembly or your class in the morning or whenever, tēnā koutou. Um, the next three that I've put in, I've put them in because they are sort of, I really like patterns and these three follow a pattern. So ata māri is uh, our, one of our greetings for good morning. Ata is the kupu Māori for morning, and Māori means um, it means peaceful or or, or um, ha happy, but peaceful morning. So Ata Māori is you're wishing people a peaceful morning or restful morning. Ahi ahi, ahi ahi is our kupu Māori for afternoon. So ahi ahi Māori is a is a greeting for have a have a good afternoon. Uh, so this one you could use as your tamariki, as your children leave at the end of the day or or when you come back from lunch or all sorts of spaces. And poor mari, you may have heard on the news at night time, it is one of our greetings for good evening or good night. So it can, it can be used as people go off to bed at night time or guests leave or, or arrive, poor mari. So the reason I like this is because it's a nice pattern of using mari at different times of the more of the day and learning the kupu ata ahi ahi and po for the different times of the day now there's many other greetings that we have and um, and you will discover those along the way but here's here's a start for you anyway so we've got kilda tena kwe for hello to one person Tēnā kōrua for hello to two people. And those kupu there, kwe, kōrua and koto, you'll be able to use them in different contexts as well. Atamari for good morning. Ahiahi mari for good afternoon. And poor Māori for good evening. They're great ones to use and practice. I always suggest the people that we pick one that we're really going to nail for a wee bit. And then it may sound funny if we're changing from saying hello to kia ora or tēnā koe or ata māori. Um, but then after a while, the more we use it, it'll feel more and more normal and it will become what we naturally go to rather than relying on the English greetings that we have. So my suggestion, is, if you don't already do it, is a good place to start is in the morning 
because if you think you're going to use a greeting in the morning, you've got all your colleagues you can greet, or your tamariki as you walk through the school grounds, there might be parents or all sorts. So you get all that practice every morning of one greeting that you've chosen to use that time. And that way, after a couple of weeks, you might be ready to change it up and pick another greeting. So those are some simple greetings. You no doubt will have some more that you've heard and use the course to ask those questions about what they might mean or what's the correct pronunciation or are you using them in the right context. So koina, koina tā, tā tātou mahi i tēnei wiki. Uh, we're obviously moving into no hia tātou this week, um, but remembering to jump in the course whenever you can, check out what other people are posting, learn from each other as well as learning from myself. So i runga i tērā whakaaro, uh, nei rā o koe mihi ki a koutou, ko te tūmanako, ki a noho uh, ora pai koutou katoa, ki a pai hoki tō koutou mahi. So I hope you're all well and that your work is going well currently. So we'll finish with karakia and looking forward to seeing you guys online or the work that you're posting. Takina te karakia. Ko whakairea te tapu, ki a wātea ai te ara, Kia tūru ki whakataha ai, kia tūru ki whakataha ai, haumie, huie, tāiki. Kia ora tātou, have a great week.